about a minute ago and you came at me sideways i've been trying something new it's a new day i got my smoke i got my thing i ain't been thinking of you i've been making moves while you in the coma chilling in the corner just like that all righty, folks, we are back on the Zoom with the lovely Polly A. Bienvenida, mi amor. Oh, welcome. Oh, she knows a little bit of Spanish. Hey. Very nice. Turn up. All right, let's take a seat, everybody. One, two, three. Wow. Wow. Now, ah. I get excited when we get music on the show that uh -huh. I really, really dig. All right, and I really, really dig your music. We were Thank talking you. right before the introduction. Right, Hip hop, R and B. You know, you were because I hear, I hear all those elements. You know, in, throughout the course of your music, but yeah. you don't think in terms of a genre, do you? Never, never. Like I've, I grew up listening to everything from reggae music. My mom's nice. Jamaican, so nice. Oh, nice. reggae music, obviously hip hop, R and B, and soul. Like Marvin Gaye is my favorite singer, so mm. it's all in there. Yeah, I love the beats. Love yeah, Thank I mean, I, I even I was listening to Ghetto Gold Dream, mm. uh. which is which is your, your slow song. I'm not the slow song kind of guy, <laughs> okay. but I dug it. And yeah. I, dug, I dig the lyrics too. I mean, you're saying something. Thank you. Yeah. Thank now, you. you write for a lot of artists too, besides doing your own music, right? I do. Like, I do. Who, who has picked up your songs? Um, Alicia Keys, wow. J. Cole, Selena Gomez, actually, Ricky Martin, random. Wow. Which song did you write for him? I just yeah. saw him yeah. before. He might have performed yeah. one of your songs. Um, it's a, like a song. He actually only performed it on, on a Victoria's Secret oh. runway. Okay. Um, cool. But yeah, it's a song that Will I Am produced. Just random. Wow. Okay, just wow. little people out yeah. there in the music industry. <laughs> just Will I Am. Whatever. Do you and have then, to hustle to get them to like do your songs? Like, do you have to like sell yourself pretty much? I don't really do it. Okay. Um, it's usually the producer or just people, you know, who are on my team. Okay. But yeah, it is a hustle and it is kind of like right place, the right time, but. Right. And talking about that too, I mean, right now, obviously you have a whole team behind you mm -hmm. doing it, but you have, you know, the, the first times that this started happening was in Times Square in New York. Oh. You're from <laughs> there. I want to know right. this story because, you know, it inspires me a lot to see how yes. people started and then, you know, the journey of how they get to where they are right now. So how was it like it for you? Man, I Performing always... Performing on the train and all that. Yeah, like I had a typical, you know, girl from a small town, like from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, uh -huh. and goes like to New York. Town. Well, it's small <laughs> relative it's all to, to here. Okay, okay. like, New York, you know, it may as well. It's a totally different world. So, yeah, I just moved to New York and, um, I was singing on the subway. That was more for fun, more for to just get out there, but I always wanted to pursue music, and it really is just about, like, putting yourself out there, especially when you don't know anybody. You know, you don't know anybody in the industry. You just have to, like, put yourself out there as much as possible, so that's what I did. That's what I did, you know? And you would sell your demos out on the street, too? I did. How much would wow. you sell them for? <laughs> I think, like, $7. Wow. Oh, nice. Hell yeah. yeah. So I people were buying come them. Up. I mean, it was not in, you know, I didn't go platinum or anything, but. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, it was, it was, it was when you were still listening to CDs, because now yeah. it's like, download me on Spotify, yeah, no, no. what are you doing? Oh, there's still people selling the, uh, CDs on Venice. Oh, yeah, just walk through and tell you. Walk through Venice, tell you. They're not, they're not handing out, like, little flash drives. Now, wow. you're signed to Interscope right now? I am. That's, I mean, that's a label with a lot of tradition. How did you sign with them, and do you, are you like, were you aware of, you know, what they've, how they've impacted hip hop and all that? Um, yeah, like Interscope is legend. I mean, legendary artists have, you know, it's an honor to be a part of just that roster. Um, I'm actually signed through Adam Levine. Okay. Oh. He has an imprint at Interscope, right. so it's like not direct, but it's still their staff and you know all of that. But yeah, it's amazing. It's amazing to just be co-signed like right. that, you know? Yeah. Now, the A in your name is for Amorous, is that correct? <laughs> so Poly Poly A is for polyamorous, yeah. Besides uh, being polyamorous <laughs> in terms of your talent, are you polyamorous <laughs> in your romantic life? Yeah, is it a poly are you, are you, we are so good about that. The people got to know. By the way, we're all polyamorous here. We're not, we're not with each other necessarily. This is a, we're actually, we have sex is what he's trying to say. Oh, wow. Well, you guys all look like loves, so... Oh, thank you, darling. <laughs> well, where, did, where's the, the name question. come from? Don't let her obey the, the Maybe, answer. You're not going to get away with this. Yes. So. Um, I'm, not, I'm not polyamorous in the sense of, like, multiple lovers. Okay. It really just means, like, I am a, a lover of all. Like, it's a love oh. movement. You know what I mean? Oh. Like, unity. Yeah, one yeah. love. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. Uh -oh, you know what I'm saying? Theory. I think it started off and you were like, oh yeah, let me do poly because I'm going through a polyamorous, but you didn't realize it was a phase, and then you got another phase, and now you're like, 
okay, Polier <laughs> has to now refer to something else. But where did <laughs> I found somebody? Where did it come from originally? Like, where? How did you even come up with this? Um, I was um working on a, I was writing a script okay. called Polyamorous, okay. and it was just like. New York art, art artist based script about like the lives of New York artists, right. independent grinding, and uh, Salam Remy, who I'm signed yeah. to through publishing. Um, I was I called him to help me produce it and develop it, and he was like, "Yo, like that's a dope name. Like, mm. what if yeah, you just yeah, because Polly, became, right? Yeah, poly, like poly. poly. And I was like, Polyamorous sounds like a group, so I shortened it, Polly A, and I was it. like to represent just. Love, yeah. It's really cool, actually. Yeah. Thank yeah. you. Now, I do really you like buy it. the demos from other artists when they're selling them out <laughs> on the street? That's what I'm curious to know. <laughs> do you support the cause? Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. That sounds more like If you're no. killing it, if you're killing it, okay. you know what I'm saying? I, yeah. I do support it. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I, that's what I thought. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a good mix of things going on, I gotta say. Thank you. Got, you. You, got, you got the voice, first of all. Thank you. You got the look. She's Thank got the look. You. Yeah. She's got the personality. Do you is LA because I mean you're coming from a real place. Like Milwaukee is a, a real place. Mm -hmm. New York is more of a real place, but not completely. Then you come out here to La La Land, where you're like, oh, yo, this is is this fake to me? Like, are you feeling that? Um, you know, people always say that about LA, and obviously there is that element. There is a layer of that, but I haven't really encountered that as much. Like, I think people out in LA are super chill. Maybe it's like the weed, I don't know. Maybe there you go, <laughs> there you go. Hey, yeah. and by the way, That's we're gonna hang out after the show after that comment. I got some good stuff in my car, okay? <laughs>